Welcome to Digital Toolbox. In this video we're going to go over the Mental Ray Daylight System and how 3ds can set up a daylight system so you can render photorealistic renderings uh, with um, true to life exposure values um, for any specific uh, latitude and longitude at your specific site, any day of the year, any time of the day, and uh, you can even animate it. So we're going to go over to the Create tab just like you're going to create a new object or a light or a camera. On the very right there's Systems. We'll click on that and go to Daylight. When I click on it it'll say you're creating the daylight system. Do you want exposure control? Um, yes, of course I do. It's kind of the point. So now I'm ready to create it. Go up to my top view and uh, up is going to be north here. So I'll click and drag and I'll get a compass rose. It doesn't really matter, just make sure it's a decent scale uh, for your model. And then you can drag out the sun. Uh, this white head uh, shows you that blue line is the incident angle. Uh, so click wherever and you can see kind of in section the that's the sun. So you can right click to get out of it or click on the move button just so you can move it around your scene. So you can drag it around and the instant angle is still the same. Uh, it's That's the full system, the compass and the uh, head part. So you can see it's named Compass001. Brilliant. Uh, we'll go over to the modify and click on the that sun, the daylight assembly head is called so daylight 001 uh, again a great name so the modify panel has all these uh, uh, everything you can want to set it up here we'll go down to position and date time and location is set up uh, so we'll click on setup to uh, fine tune that and it'll be under control parameters um, date, time, and location, uh, azimuth, and altitude, so you can set that up. Uh, or you can get a location, uh, or set up your own latitude and longitude down to the 10,000th of the uh, hour, minute. And, you know, click on whatever one you want. San Francisco is fine, it's default. So that's, this will be for San Francisco, and then if I kind of scroll out here, um, I can see what that angle is, so this is the at noon, and then I can see it pan across the sky, and then you can also select the month, so if you want to test out something long winter hours, or that long winter sun, or the uh, long summer hours and test out some you know, shading devices or something uh, this is how you do it so setting your location latitude and longitude and the north direction as well uh, in case north isn't exactly um, that top degree it's not orthogonal to the site uh, you can cheat it and you know tilt this a, a, a little bit if it's off uh, depending on how you're, you modeled your site. And then you can fine tune in the um, hour and day that you're there and get on to rendering.